Hey guys, what's up? It's Alex, another Photoshop tutorial for you guys. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to add fonts because if you want to have like certain specific font um, and you don't know how to fix that and stuff, I'll be running through all the steps you need to follow and stuff to get like any font you want. So um, yeah, without further ado, let's jump right into it. All right, so as you can see, I'm not in Photoshop right now. So I'm just going to go to Google and just we want to type in the best website for fonts you can download free is just thefont.com. This one. And then we are on the website. So basically, you have all kinds of fonts. I think there are make like thousands of fonts. I don't want I don't want to say million, but there are thousands of free fonts you can just download right away. If we want to have like a handwritten kind of word, just we're gonna just at the right at the search bar, we're gonna type in handwritten. Simple as that. All the things are just popping up. And if we want to see how it looks on a specific word, we can type in this little bar. We're gonna just type in just Alex Halford. And as you can see, we have all kinds of fonts popping up, like with my name. So you can see how it looks before you download it. Let's say I want, I like this one. We're just gonna go to the right and click on download. Then this is gonna pop up. You want to just want to open it with WinRAR or WinZip or whatever your um, extracting program is. You want to click OK, and then this folder opens. So basically, what I'm gonna do now is we just want to double click on the font. Look at this window. But this is Dutch, and this is, is installeren. It's it's Dutch for installing. Just throwing that out there. So you get this window, and just want to click on install. And we're just going to wait until it's loading. And normally when you install it right away, you should be able to use that font in Photoshop. It's really simple. It's going to take a few seconds to um, install the font. It's not that big. So basically you just want to wait a few seconds, look anything you want. So basically the, there the window pops up and that was it. It is installed. So the name of this font is Fitra Design. You need to save whatever you're doing or you just can just discard it if you don't mind. But if you are like making something, just save it close Photoshop for a minute. Okay, I've restarted Photoshop as you can see. So download the font, save your whatever you're doing and click it away, close Photoshop, close the process, whatever, and just restart it. Basically what we're gonna do now, I'm gonna open a document real quick. So let's say 920 by 1080, let's do this. All right, we wanna just go to the text icon right there. We're gonna click and just we're gonna uh, type in the word test to make it a little bit bigger. I have this test word as you can see. So we want to just open our list as you can see and it's right underneath it. Petra design handwritten. So we will just click on that. And as you can see, we have the font. So you can edit, let's say we want to write Alex. As you can see, we have, we can do everything. You can do everything. You can change the color of this. You can download any font you want. I'll leave in the description down below the steps you need to follow to go to the website and how to use it in Photoshop, the font. If you like this video and you find this video helpful, feel free to reward it with a thumbs up down below. It's always appreciated. And if you want to see more of these Photoshop tutorials, feel free to subscribe down below. Then you get a notification anytime a new video goes live. You know, that's what it's there for. So, and I want to mention though, tomorrow there's not going to be a Photoshop tutorial because it's Christmas and I will put out a video definitely so you are just not missing out any videos just tomorrow two new videos and i will see you guys friday with a new photoshop tutorial the last one of the week but i'll be back next week for new photoshop tutorials as always you guys you guys know how it works so basically i want to thank you guys very much for watching this video i want to wish all my subscribers a merry christmas and thank you all for sticking around with me like for more than like almost like two and a half years on this channel it's been nothing but incredible to make videos for you guys and you know and all that kind of stuff to get to see the likes and the comments and everything it blows my dutch brain i want to thank you guys and i'll see you guys Friday for a new video and until then I'll see you guys Friday